Hi guys, welcome back. Today we're going to show you how to make this basket for your milk crate. Ours is going to be a little bit different, but still the same thing. And then we'll show you how to make some miniature um, milk bottles and a basket out of the chicken wire. This is ours. This is the kind you get at the store that's store bought. It's very nice quality. Um, and these are wooden. All right, so the very first thing you're going to do is get yourself some quarter inch chicken wire. And then you want to go ahead and cut them like this. You want to cut the corners out of it. You want to leave this wire and leave that wire. So we're going to do it this way. Cut those two. And cut those two. And that corner will come right out. You do the same thing to all four corners. Okay, so this is what it should look like with all four corners and you see how each one has a line and it doesn't look like it has the edge that's sharp like this. See how that doesn't have the line right there? You don't want that. You want it to look like this. Okay, and now we're gonna bend it. All know. right, so here we go. All right, it's gonna be easy just to take, because this is thin. You just wanna bend it on that last wire And you get it like that. And we'll bend it on the last one again. And then we'll bend the side. Might be easier to get my finger in there with this. And the same thing over here. And you can play with it a little bit to get it even. All right, and after that, you want to grind the top so you don't have sharp edges. And if you don't have a grinder, you can use a file that will file metal. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and there you have it. You definitely don't want any kid to play with this that is going to get cut or swallow it. Yeah. So it's going to have small parts, so be careful with that. All right, the next thing you want to do is you want to get something that's round. I'm just using this little clamp here. And you want to bend a piece of wire around that to get that shape that looks like a U. All right. Once you have the U shape, then we need to create the handles that's going to be locked down in there. And I just bent it around the middle piece. All right. And since I'm holding the camera, Dad's going to go ahead and bend these inward. Come in about... Uh, eighth of an inch, maybe three sixteenths of an inch, and get it started around there. Around there, then we want to crimp it together, but not all the way. You don't want to crimp it all the way until you get it onto the basket. And just get it like that. Then we'll put it on the basket and bend it the rest of the way. But we're going to have to grind that one. Now you want to put it in the center hook. And then just squeeze it together. see it or not and there you have it all right and then you have two milk baskets or soda baskets or shopping baskets you can even use them like when you're going shopping at the store and you get the little basket and you can do two little handles as opposed to one and you can paint it green or red like the ones in the store are for that purpose and um, if you want to use it for milk, you can. And to make your milk bottles, all we did was take a wooden dowel and sand the edge at an angle by just yeah. rolling it. It's better off if you got put in the drill and shape it because these are crude, done by... <laughs>
Okay, so using the drill and putting it in the drill, it turns it out a lot nicer. Try and see if I can focus it up there some for you so you can see it a little bit better. And then just cut the bottom off. 